In today's Bad 21 tip, I want to show you a man beating concept that you can utilize from your own playbook uh, in Man 21, but it works really, really well out of the Arizona Cardinals playbook as well. What's up, guys? My name is Cody. Now, for those of you that have never been to my channel before, I just want to thank you for taking the time to watch today's video. I guarantee you that it's going to be something tactical and tangible that you can apply to your own game. Now, those of you that know me know that I upload four videos a day here on YouTube with tips and tricks just like this that are designed to give you some food to chew on as you go through and become the best Madden player you can be. And one of the things that we really highly lo love about this game is the Arizona Cardinals uh, offense, especially the air raid offense. And so we're going to be going over a man beater out of that playbook. Um, now, if you have any Madden questions or you want to uh, get connected with some other guys that are running the air raid offense, I would highly recommend joining our text membership. That is completely free to do. I give exclusive tips every single week. So far, we've covered uh, how to stop the run from every single formation in Madden. We've also covered a 45-minute free guide on the gun cluster formation. So if you have not subscribed, um, or I'm sorry, if you have not joined the text message membership, just shoot me a text and let me know you'd like to be in it. It is my personal cell phone number. My number is 812-216-3644. So literally there's no um there's no you're not a part of a mass text or anything like that it's just individually um just people that i know that i want to send a video to once a week that is exclusive to just them we don't show it on our discord we don't show it on our youtube channel it's just for our texting members that being said we do have a discord if you want to join that um, there's a lot of good stuff over there as well all right guys i want to talk a little bit about man-to-man -man coverage and specifically a route that i really like the, to use and there's really two um two major routes from the spread wide flex and i'm going to use the play um why sale this is a very very good man beating concept and all i like to do with this if you're just trying to beat man to man i would highly recommend motioning equanimous st brown to the right and basically just snapping the ball once he gets set up and what you'll see is his route is going to beat man to the inside as you can see right there as long as it doesn't get pressed that route is really really effective so when you put it in motion um, and you see here, I'll, I'll just press coverage. When you put his route in motion, once he passes that tackle, he's going to be snapped in motion. So he's not going to be able to get bumped, and that's going to be huge for him to be able to get that separation. That route is amazing against man-to-man -man coverage. What's also really unique about this specific play is it's going to cause a little bit of a man switch some, with some formations. Um, you'll see that he will he will get flipped a little bit, but this running back is going to get uh, wide open against man-to-man -man as well. As you can see right there, he's going to be able to get to the sideline and get open against man-to-man -man coverage. And then also the route um, to the tight end. This route is one of the one of the hidden gems I think of Madden 21 that most people aren't utilizing. At least I wasn't utilizing it like I should have. Um, but this this route right here, you'll see if he faces man to man, just low ball it once he cuts, and you're gonna see he is gonna consistently beat man to man. That's um, Robert Tonyan who has like crap route running, nothing too fancy um, for him going up against a high speed safety of the Patriots. And what you're seeing is he is just roasting him. Uh, and we're going to be able to consistently get the ball up the field um, with that route combination right there. The next thing that I will uh, recommend on this is to just kind of peek, um, just kind of peek it up to the uh, Devontae Adams. If they if they if they press coverage and he uh, beats the press, you know you can hit that over the top for a one play touchdown if they're press manning and they're taking their safeties away. But the next read on this play is this in route. This in route will typically get separation. As a general rule, in-breaking patterns are very, very effective against man-to-man -man coverage. So within this play, you basically have four routes that beat cover two press man, and then you have a route that's really, really good as well against cover zero. If they're not, if they're not respecting Devonte Adams and his ability to get off the bump um, deep, then what you'll see, like maybe they'll drop a, maybe they'll drop that safety on that right side to try to take away that little route to uh, Robert Tonyan. Well, you can hit this route to Devontae Adams over the top. You just want to click on the, to the wide receiver and make sure that you're swerve catching him over the top. Now, I would recommend with that route, it is a good, fast receiver. Uh, Devontae Adams, in fact, is a little bit slow for that route, but he gets the job done just because of his high, high, deep route running. If they have good deep route running, you have a good quarterback, you can kind of fit that in there. Um, but if you have a route chemistry, like Devontae Adams has a route chemistry, one thing I, I highly recommend is putting him on a deep post. That makes this play just 
a very very powerful force because now um, there's a little bit of a scissors action that's going to occur for Devontae Adams and if they take those safeties away you're still going to be able to beat man-to-man um, -man over the top in fact if they take them away even if they shade coverage over top you're going to see by putting Devontae Adams on a deep post route and you can only do this with certain receivers um, but he is going to basically be one-on-one -on -one with Richard Sherman or not Richard Sherman, Stephon Gilmore. And if that's any corner other than Stephon Gilmore with one step ahead, that's going to get that separation uh, against the man-to-man -man coverage. So that's just something that you know you can kind of do with the Packers that you can't really do with other teams. Um, I think the only other team you would be able to do this with is the uh, Saints. But you'll see right there we were, we were uh, McCourty just with that high zone coverage just going to come over and make the play. But if they take the safeties away – which they probably will because they you've got so many underneath reads. Um, and so what's going to happen is they're going to get aggressive and they're going to start taking safeties away. They're going to start taking, uh, trying to take routes away by doing that. So by you having, you know, kind of being one step ahead, uh, ironically, and running that post right over the top, now you've got them, you know, in multiple little areas here. So this play really does torch man-to-man -man as a consistent yard uh uh, yardage type of play. This route to Robert Tawny is the route I really wanted to highlight um, because it's been ran on me a lot this year, and I honestly have not respected how good it is. Um, but these little stock out routes are very, very effective. Now, one thing you will see, and how rare, I mean, it's very rare that I would do something like this, but if I wanted to, I could literally take Tawny in motion to the left, snap it while he's in motion, and you'll see he'll cook man to man there as well. The primary reason I don't do that is because oftentimes the user is in the middle of the field, so I just don't like to mess with that. But this route combination this year is very effective, and um, you're going to have a lot of success with that. Now, like I said, be sure to join the tech membership if you want the full ebook that I wrote on Arizona Arizona's um, offensive scheme with over. Um, it's over 89 pages of breakdowns on just Arizona, and it also comes with my full defensive scheme from the 4-6 ebook, 4-6 defense. Um, it comes with that full scheme, and that full scheme, uh, as a, I think it's an additional 45 pages or, or something like that. I think it's more than that. It's probably 50 pages. But the whole guide together, the competitive bundle guide, which is my full offense and my full defense for the year, is just $25, and it's over 125 pages with over, I think, six or seven hours, at least six or seven hours of video breakdown and film breakdown. So it's a highly, highly detailed and highly specific and highly, really effective uh, ebook in my opinion. So if you haven't picked up that, I would highly encourage you to do that. There's a link to pick that ebook up in the description of this video. But that does it for me today, guys. Be sure to join the Discord. You can join the texting membership 100% free of charge. Um, all you have to do is just shoot me a text, and you can always text me your Madden question and last but not least guys we'll be streaming tonight at 10 o'clock p.m eastern time i'd love to see you come hang out with us on youtube twitch or facebook gaming thank you so much for your time today and we'll see you guys in a little bit